In this video, I'll run through what I believe is the best camera settings for each position in competitive pro clubs, based on my experience playing in a couple of these positions as well as opinions from other top players. I play on a 24-inch monitor so my settings may look different if you have a varying TV or monitor. Firstly, GK. This is not something I really have any knowledge about, but in my competitive league, nearly every GK plays on the pro camera angle. My understanding gives you the best view to judge where a player will be shooting. Settings I would leave it at default, but if there are any GKs, please comment down below on what to use. Center back. Talking to the top center backs in Oz, most of them have said they play on co-op. A big part of center back is reading and tracking potential through balls which are being played. Co-op allows you to be proactive and see the player attempting to make the pass. Co-op also allows you to see both your fullbacks, so if you're in trouble you can play a safe pass to them, relieving pressure. For the camera setting I would recommend 20 height and 20 zoom. This allows you to be closer to the pitch, making tackling and interceptions easier without jeopardizing your view for potential dangerous through balls. Fullback. I won't go into this much as it's essentially the same reasoning as a centre back. One of the biggest tasks of fullback is the switch. This is very important in competitive games to disrupt the swarm of the other team and create space. If you have a problem seeing the switch on those cop settings state in CB, reduce the zoom accordingly. DM. This is my position. In my opinion, there are two ways to go about the camera setting, depending on your playstyle. If you are an attacking DM who has the ability to create, I recommend using telebroadcast with camera height set as 20 and zoom set as 0. This allows you to see harder pass opportunities in the final third and it allows better control if you like to dribble in order to create space. The other way is co-op, using the same settings as centre back and full back. I would use this if you play more of the basic role on DM, playing safe passes the majority of the time and use skills sparingly. This is a safe bet to use if your team doesn't like you pushing up and helping the attack. Cam. I played Cam at comp level in a draft and found Tele to be the most effective, using the same settings as the first DM option. Cams are meant to create, and Tele gives you the best opportunity to do so. The reasoning behind the camera is very similar to my DM camera, as it allows you to see the potential slips better as well as making dribbling and the creation of space easier. Striker and Wings. You want to use the same setting that I've suggested in Cam. I won't go into much detail as it's pretty parallel to the Cam in terms of reasoning. One thing though which is important in these positions is beating that final man to create space for a shot at goal or to hit that final pass. Playing for zoomed out camera makes this job a little bit harder. In these positions you may only get one chance in a game and I believe this camera gives you the best opportunity to make that chance count. In conclusion, there are two cameras which I believe are the best for competitive pro clubs. For defense and possibly DM I recommend Culp. For the attack I recommend Telebroadcast. It may seem unwarranted to care about something as non-influential as a camera. The smallest advantages make a difference since the skill gap is not that high in pro clubs. Like all my guide videos, this is my opinion as well as opinions gathered from other top Oz players in their respective positions. If you disagree with anything, tell me why in the comments below. Thanks for watching.